Always uh, love being able to bring you information about events that are coming up, but also really interesting when you have a, a great keynote speaker that's going to be at one of these events. And I'd like to introduce you to, well, no introduction needed for the Chief. Uh, chief uh, Charles Bordeaux is joining us from Ottawa Police Services. You're also the uh, Youth Service Bureau's, uh, the Foundation's uh, Chair. So I you're am, the yes. chairperson for that. Uh, great to have you here. And Franco Days is joining us, the Second Cup co-founder who has quite the story of a lifetime. Great to have you on our show. Oh, it's fun to be here, yeah. The one, I, the one thing I want to get to, because it's something that you're speaking at, is the Auto Police Gala that's happening on the 20th at the Convention Centre. Can you give us a, a quick rundown of, of what the event is? Because it's a big night for you guys. It is a big night. It's our third annual gala we're doing. And the, we try to accomplish three things. One is to celebrate uh, policing and to celebrate the history, the rich history of policing in Ottawa. Secondly, we want to recognize our members and the great job they do day in and day out. And thirdly, we want to give back to the community. Uh, the first year we raised some money for, uh, for Project STEP, the second year the mission, and this year we're proud to uh, raise money for YSB, the Youth Services Bureau. Um, you know, mental health has been a, a key issue in our community, and uh, we recognize that uh, we want to be able to help an agency uh, that's out there delivering quality services and helping our youth in our community. Is this, so, something, is this something that your members look forward to, almost a night to step out of the job, but to embrace what it is that you represent in our community? Very much so. You know, they give back uh, thousands of hours in the community, and this is an opportunity to, to celebrate that. And uh, we're so pleased that, that Frank agreed to come and speak to us and, uh, and uh, help us put things into context and see how police officers, how they contribute to making our communities healthier and safer and to share his experience. And your experience goes in so many different ways. For people who don't quite know your story, the co-founder of Second Cup, an amazing Canadian success story, but that wasn't, that, that was the, the, the highlight part. Really, right. it was a, a much tougher uh, beginning for you, a lot of struggles. Indeed, I, I found myself uh, on the streets, living on the streets in Toronto uh, some 40 years ago and living in a flop house, 50 cents a night, three guys to a room panhandling for nickels and dimes on Young Street. Most important decision of the day was would we get 50 cents each so we could sleep indoors or sleep on a park bench. Or, and, um, and so I'm really delighted that the uh, Ottawa Police Services are doing this, this kind of work in the community. They're to be congratulated because these kids out there are, each one has their own story just like I do. And, and, and I was so lucky to have a group that caught me when I was ready to change. When, it, when the time came, it was time to change. There were people there to support me, and that's, a, that's what Ottawa Youth Services does. It's great to see that. I, I think it is understanding that every, every child out there, every person out there does have a story. And so your story to tell at these events, it must, does it range in terms of the type of audience that you're speaking to? Because you can talk on a, at a business forum where you can talk about social services. Sure, but you know, the, the, the overall mission is really uh, is to talk about three things. Hope, vision, action. Everybody has to have some hope in their lives, and, and uh, Ottawa Youth Services provides that hope for some of these kids that are really in difficulty. And once they have hope, they can begin to have a vision for themselves, for better better life for themselves, and then on from there. And then, then there's an, they have to take the action. And the support of uh, Ottawa Youth Services gives them the ability to take the action to change their lives and become something useful. Tremendous organization. Uh, it'll be really interesting to hear, and I think too from the perspective of the officers that are often maybe dealing with people who are on the streets too, it, it's really a full circle with the event that's going to be happening. It is, and like Frank said, every youth, every uh, they each have a story, and it's important for our officers uh, to be out there and to listen to the youth and to help them and to guide them uh, so that when they're ready to deal with their issues, that they have a place like YSB to go to. And we refer a lot of people to YSB. Great to have the two of you on your show. Congratulations on your life story. It's really quite remarkable. Thanks, it really is. Uh, the, a gala once again, Ottawa Police Gala, happening on the 20th at the Ottawa Convention Center.